No stranger to the law, rapper slash actor DMX has run into a lot of cops over the years, but he never impersonated one until 2004. No, there's a road one thing crazier than DMX's rap career is his rap sheet. He's been charged with everything from animal cruelty to identity theft. People get arrested for normal stuff, like, you know, whatever, shoplifting. The things that DMX get arrested for are, like, really out there. Like, he's had a scriptwriter helping him come up with scenarios. <laughs> Yet there's one arrest to rule them all. In June 2004, DMX and a friend were leaving a parking lot at JFK Airport and didn't feel like paying a $9 fee. So DMX pulls out a siren, puts it on top of his car, and claims to be an FBI agent. Not just a cop, but an FBI agent. When that didn't fly, he busted through the gate, but damaged his SUV too severely to drive it. His car is all messed up and everything, so he jumps out and commandeers... Another car still, still claiming to be an FBI agent. And then the real authorities showed up. The police pull him over, search the car. What do they find? Surprise! Crack and Depakote, a prescription drug for bipolar disease. They were charged with attempted robbery, criminal impersonation, and more. DMX had really been getting into his acting in action movies and may have forgotten at that moment that he wasn't in fact, an FBI agent. The Rough Rider was let off easy with a conditional discharge, but rehabilitation just wasn't in the picture. Since then, he's been busted and jailed multiple times, including a 2009 stretch for theft, drug possession, and the list goes on. His runnings have now become legendary. I mean, when you go from making platinum albums to choking correctional officers in prison right now, I mean, you know, what else is left here to do, man? Talk is cheap!